Good morning, everybody. Let's have some service today on this first Sunday of June. It's worship hour. Hallelujah. Yeah. For the Lord is my shepherd. I have everything I need. Helps me to rest in the meadow's grass. Yeah. Lay beside a quiet stream. He restores my failing health. Helps me to do what honors him the most. That's why I'm safe. That's why I'm safe. That's why I'm safe. Safe in, in his arms. Hallelujah. For the Lord is my shepherd, and I have everything I need. Helps me to rest in the meadow's grass. Lay beside a quiet stream. He restores my failing health. Helps me to do what honors him the most. That's why I'm safe. That's why I'm safe. That's why I'm safe. Hey, hey. I'm safe in, in his arms, yeah. And when the storm, when the storm, yeah, hallelujah, of life is raging and the billows and the billows and the billows That he shall hide me. I'm, I'm so glad that he shall hide me. I, I'm glad, hallelujah, that he Give him praise. This is your hour. This is your hour. This is your time to worship. We are safe in the arms of Jesus. Trouble may come, but it won't last always. We're safe 
in the arms of Jesus. Come on, come on, come on. Put two hands, put two hands together and praise him. Worship him right now. Hallelujah. We thank God for this brand new month. Uh, six months into the year of 2024. June uh, 1st have went by and today is June 2nd. We thank God for being here today on this communion Sunday, the first Sunday of June. And I come to tell you, no matter what the world got going on, we're safe <laughs> in his arms. Oh, bless his name today. I don't know about you, but I feel all right this morning. I'm thankful for being here today on this communion Sunday. Yes, if you want to join us in communion, get your communion ready. We're going to bless it and we're going to go forth after the service today. Hallelujah. 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 Right now at this time, though, I'm going to ask my wife, Miss Gail Botts, if she will, to read our prayer list and uh, our birthdays and everything. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. At this time, our first lady, Miss Gail Botts. Good morning. Good morning. Yeah. Fred Jones and family. Bless his and name. And the loss of their brother, Reverend Ed Jones. Mm, mm, mm. We have the Campbell family. Bless we God. We have Ginger Fruit Home. Yes. We have Gaynell Adams, Richard Elder, Annie Lee, and Carolyn Box. Hallelujah. We're continuing to pray for Ellis and Ricky Box. We're always praying for our mom and entire family. And then we have celebrating birthdays. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nick Cairo. Happy birthday. And Tony Banks. Happy birthday to my good friends, my good friends. Amen, amen, we thank God amen. for all of you that have tuned in this morning uh, to the church family, Pastor Chambers and his wife, Carolyn, uh, and uh, to all of you uh, that's feeling the loss of Reverend Ed Jones. Uh, he was a good friend of ours, very helpful over the years with the Starlights, our Hearts go out to Fred Jones and Melvin Roy of Georgia. We know you guys are feeling that loss, and we're here with you. We thank God for all of you this morning that have joined in, and we're praying for you. Let us pray at this time. Father God, we come right now. We thank you, Lord, for you, Lord your power. We thank you, Lord, for what you're able to do. Father God, we pray that you will lift up a bow-down head this morning. Father, even though our hearts are filled with sadness, Father, our spirits are are filled with joy because we know that Pastor Ed made it in and we just want to say thank you. So we know that earth have no sorrow that heaven will not heal, Father. And we just say thank you. We thank you, Lord, for all that you're doing. We thank you for what you've done, Father. There are so many that need you right now. Somebody's lying in a convalescent home, Father. Bless right now. Father, give them the strength, Father, to carry through, Father. We thank you, Lord, for those that are in financial ruins, Father, but we know that you're still able. We thank you, Lord, for all that you're doing. Lord, you've been so good and so kind. We just stopped by this morning to say thank you. As we celebrate you, Father, you told us as often as we do communion to do it in remembrance of you. So we just say thank you, Father, and we remember, Father, that you died this morning on the cross that we might have a right to the tree of life. Thank you, Father, for every person that pour out a gift on this ministry. Don't let our work be in vain, Father. We're not perfect, but Father, we're trying to reach perfection through you, Father God. And you told us only what we do for Christ will last. So we give you all the glory, the honor, and the praise, Father. There might be a name that we didn't call today, but you know who they are, Father. Touch them right now with your finger of love, your healing power. In the name of Jesus, we pray today. Keep me and Gail together, Father. United, Father, as one, Father, in this ministry, G-Box ministry. Thank you, Lord, for our children, our parents, Father, mom, Father, and our brothers and sisters. We just say thank you for our families. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen, amen, and amen. We thank all of you for tuning in one more time. Uh, we thank God for what he's doing over here at G-Box ministry. And we pray that we're helping and blessing somebody. We're just so thankful today. Thank all of you that give, our partners that uh, send us a donation every yes. month. I want to send a shout out to my sister Kalada and yes. brother Terrell and uh, Mother Spencer and all of you uh, that always uh, turn aside to give. Deacon uh, Mason in Georgia, we thank you and yes. Mother Grant. And there are so many, uh, Sherry and, and uh, uh, I can't come on, help me out, Lisa, and so many more. I, I don't like to call names because I'll forget Dee Dee. 
We thank all of you. You guys have been so good in helping us help others. And there's many more. And we just yes. want to say thank you, thank you for all that you do. Jamerson, we thank yes. you, sir. Yes. want to thank Billy yes. in Palmdale <laughs> because Billy from Palmdale really blessed me last Sunday. Uh, he called me, and I hadn't talked to Billy in about a year or two, but he really blessed me with his kind words. And uh, we just say thank you. Um, yeah. Sherry and David comes to mind. Always turn aside to bless us. Sheila and Roosevelt and so many more. We just say thank you guys yeah. for all that you do. And we bless God for you, Katie. And I, I, uh, this, the list goes on and on. And we just want to say thank you for pouring out a blessing uh, upon us. And we ask God to return it back to you 100 fold that we are able to bless those that are less fortunate than we are. We yes. just say thank you. Thank We're you, so grateful you. to all of you, all of our family. Mom, mom always give us a kind word every Sunday. And Valerie, we just want to say thank you, Valerie. Yeah. Uh, Gail, we'll be all day naming all these <laughs> names. But we just say thank Amen. you. We're so grateful to all of you. Veronica, your name comes to mind over in uh, Danville. So. Georgia, I mean, Danville, Virginia, and Angie Strong, my classmate. Oh, I'm just so uh, have overlaid with all bless of you. God, you guys God. have blessed us yes, over the years, yes. and we just wanted to say thank you. And if we didn't call your name, charge it to our head and not our heart, because we love all of you and truly thankful for all of you. Walter Jones, I got to throw that in there. Been sticking with me from day one. We've been friends over 30 years, and we just say thank you to him as well. Let us move on before I get myself in trouble. If you have your Bible, we're in the King James Version of the Bible today. Uh, Luke chapter 7, verse 11 through 17. That's Luke chapter 7, verses 11 through 17. And we're going to read from that scripture this morning. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And before I go a little further, it just came to my mind too. Uh, Miss Eva Walker, we just want to say thank you to the, to you. She's the daughter of my high school teacher, Evelyn Walker. Miss Walker have always supported me over the years from high school to when I got married and, and beyond. She had her 75th birthday on a cruise ship, and she booked the Starlights to do her entertainment on her birthday cruise. And we just want to say thank you to that family. She's no longer with us but they're still blessing us. And just last month, her daughter Eva called us and had a, a little communion set. And she told me that her mother would want me to have it. And, uh, and I shared with her, uh, when I became a deacon, her mother gave me a little set as well. Amen. So when I go out to serve communion to those that are uh, sick and shut in, I would have something to use. And I was always thankful to Miss Walker. Uh, she just was a jewel. And I know she's somewhere around the throne, and I'm trying my best to make her proud. Amen. Just like she was proud of me, I was thankful for her and thankful to her family. So we'll be using that communion set today, uh, Eva, and we just want to say thank you. thank you. All right, let's get into the word. Luke chapter 7, verses 11 through 17. And it came to pass the day after that he went into the city called Nain. And many of the disciples went with him, and much people. Now when he came, now when he came nigh to the gates of the city, behold, there was a dead man carried out, and, and only the son of his mother, and she was a widow, and much people of the city with her. And when the Lord saw her, he had compassion on her, and said unto her, Weep not. And he came and touched the bier, and they, they that bare him stood still. And he said, Young men, I say unto thee, Arise. Hallelujah. And he that was dead set up and began to speak, and he delivered him to his mother. And there came a fear on all, and they glorified God, saying, that a great prophet is risen up among us and that, that God has visited his people, uh, 17. And this rumor uh, of him went forth throughout all Judea and throughout all the region around about. Hallelujah. May God add a blessing to the readers, the hearers, 
and always the doers of his word. For a thought today, I want to say this to you. If he did it once, he can do it again. <laughs> I come to encourage somebody to know if he did it once, I come to tell you he can do it again. Amen, amen. Is there anybody listening to me this yes, morning? Yes. Believe that if God did it once, I come to tell you he can do it again. This is Encouragement Sunday. This is the time to get your faith uh, shored up. If God did it once, he can do it again. Amen. I come to tell you whatever you're going through or been through, if he did it once for you, if he fixed your problem, he can do it again. Come on, Pastor. Come Is there on, anybody going to believe me this morning? Yeah, Is there anybody yeah. going to help me preach this this morning? Uh, in this text, you will find that Jesus was sympathetic to the mother because she had lost her son. She already had lost her husband. If you read back, it said she was a widow. Mm -hmm. And then she lost her only son. And Jesus was sympathetic with this woman. And when he passed her, he said, weep not. He told her, don't cry because the king has come. <laughs> I come to tell you to weep not this morning because Hallelujah. the king has come. He woke you up this morning to tune in to G-Bot's ministry yes. so that you can know if he did it once, he can do it, he can again. Do it again. I don't care come what on, your Pastor. problem may be this morning. If you can show up your faith this morning to believe, only believe that all things all are things. possible. Yes, sir. Yes, and sir. I come to tell you, he can do it again. Jesus began to console her, but uh, he didn't stop there. He went over and touched the Bible, say the beer that the young man was laying on him. And uh, he told him to arise, young man. And the young man arise and spoke. Hmm. I would love to be a fly on the wall on, to know what the young man <laughs> said. He might have yeah. said, I once was dead, but now I'm alive. Hallelujah. I once was lost. But now I'm found. I, I lost, but Jesus gave Hallelujah. it back to me. Thank and if he Lord. did it Thank once, he can, he can do it again. I wish I had somebody on, to believe that if he did it once, he can <laughs> yes, do it again. God yes, sent yes. me to tell you, to remind you that if he did it once for you, he can do it yes, again. I don't Hallelujah. care what you've been through. You know, Satan likes to throw us off. And then every time we go through a situation, we want to say, oh, Lord. Huh. Don't say, oh, Lord, just say Jesus. Jesus. Holler Jesus in the <laughs> name of Jesus. Yes, if sir. you did it once, I realize Hallelujah. you can do it again. I come Hallelujah. to tell you that God can. Yes, he can. Is there anybody? Hallelujah. No, he can. He yes, can move sir. mountains yes, yes, that sir. try to defeat me. Yes, How he can calm a storm <laughs> that tries to get in my way. Yes. I come to tell you if he did it once, come on, come on. he can do it again. Yes, Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You need to know that. Uh, God is all powerful and he ain't uh, lost nothing. Huh. I don't care how many times you call on him. You can call him in the morning. You can call him in the noonday. Yes. I heard somebody yes. say, I called him at midnight. at midnight. I don't care what <laughs> time you call Jesus. He never sleeps. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes. And if he did it once, he can do it again. Come Most on, of the time on, when we hear on, about on. somebody uh, uh, was dead and came back alive, most of us only think of Lazarus. Mm. Yeah, yeah. You remember the story uh, uh, when they were crying at the grave because Mary and Martha's brother Lazarus had died and they were crying and Jesus told them, I am the resurrection. I am. I he am. reminded them that he's the one that would rise again. Yes. He told them that I am who I am. And he yes. told Lazarus, come forth. Come forth. He called <laughs> him by his name. And yes, the reason sir. he called Lazarus by his name because if he would have just said, come forth, he's so powerful, a hundred people might have came out the grave. So he made sure yes. that he called Lazarus by, by his name. name. By name. Hallelujah. Yes. Not only that, if you read on, he, he loved Lazarus. Lazarus was one of his best friends, and he, he, he felt those women pain that was crying yes. at the grave. Yes. Have you ever cried out to God? Come on. Come Hallelujah. On. I'm, I'm talking to the men out yes. there as well. Sometimes we're too much men that we don't cry. Mm -hmm. But I come to tell you that since I've been called to preach, I have never cried so much in my life. But I tell you, my tears are not of pain, are not of sorrow. They're of joy yes. because I realize more and Hallelujah. more that God can and, and he, he will. will. <laughs> yes, sir. Yes, well, I sir. wish I had a witness. Yes, if if he on, did Pastor. it once, I, I come to tell you that he can do it again. Amen. Not only did he Amen. Not only did he raise Lazarus, but if you go 
all the way back in the Bible, in the, in the Old Testament, the book of First and Second Kings, he used Elijah. Elijah laid his body on a young man and prayed, and the young man came back alive. Yes. I come to tell you that uh, Lazarus wasn't Hallelujah. the only one. Hallelujah. I come to tell you, I come to tell you Thank that you, Lord, Lazarus Jesus. wasn't the only one. He, Lord, he visited Lord. Jerry's Hallelujah. house, and he went in the house and told everybody to get out. And when he got through, they came back in. Uh, Jerry's daughter had died, but Jesus brought her back alive yes. and told yes. them when they came back in to get this child something Believe. to eat. <laughs> I come to tell you that if God did it once, Yes, he could do, do it again. I wish I had somebody Hallelujah. that Hallelujah. know when you couldn't pay your bills, God showed up and yeah. paid the bills for you. I Hallelujah. wish I had somebody Come to on, know that when they didn't have a ride, yes. God gave them a ride. I yes. wish I had somebody yes. that when they yes. taxes was due, somehow, some way, yes. God made a way out of yes. no way. Y'all yes. hold up. I ain't ready to go yes. there yet. Ah. Hallelujah. I'm going to preach this thing this morning. I come, come to on, tell Pastor. you, if God yes. can, yes. God will yes. do it yes. just for you. Or oh, I wish I had somebody I that knew this morning. Come on, come on, come on. I want to remind you of a story. We don't have to go <laughs> so far back in the Bible. I want to tell you that in 1994, there was a doctor. He was back east, and there was a great storm. And the doctor stopped at a payphone to call his mother to check on her. And when he stopped at this payphone, he <laughs> called his mother, and lightning struck that doctor. And while the doctor uh, was on the phone, he began to turn around and see that he was dead on the oh, ground. ground. Y'all ain't on, listening to on. me. Y'all don't hear me this morning. You. He looked at himself lying on the ground. And when he was lying on the ground, a lady rushed over and started doing CPR. She started pumping his mm -hmm. chest and mm -hmm. breathing in his mouth. Come and on. he's watching all this from the payphone. And then suddenly it hit this doctor that he was dead. Mm. But then he felt his spirit was coming back into his body and when he woke up, he saw the woman looking down on him and he realized that God had gave him a second chance. Second chance. I come to tell you that if he did it once, yes, he can do it again. Yes. You may have somebody somewhere sick, <laughs> but I come to tell you God is still, still. in the blessing business. Yes. Somebody want to walk yes. again. Yes. I come to tell you that God is still oh, in the blessing yeah. business. Yes, Somebody sir. is having come trouble on, with their eyes. Yes. I come to tell you that God yes. can yes. do it again. <laughs> I come to tell you today yes, that sir. if you're down and out yes, and sir. don't have no money in your pocket, come I come to tell you that we serve a God that can fill pockets and bank accounts. Hallelujah. Don't count him out because if he did it once, he can do it again. Oh, I wish I had a witness this morning. <laughs> on, I wish I had somebody on, to help me preach this thing yes, today. Sir, yes, sir, I come yes, to sir. preach to somebody yes, sir, yes, today. Sir. If he did it once, he can do it again. Yes. I come to tell you, help me, Lord, to tell the story. On, uh, the man on, uh, saw himself come back alive. He was grateful, grateful. to live again. Yes. I'm trying to tell you that if he did it once, he can do it again. <laughs> I come to tell you that he's Alpha and Omega. Yes, I come yes, to tell yes, you that yes. he's the beginning yes, yes, and the end. Yes. Uh-huh. I come to tell you that we serve a mighty God. <laughs> Hallelujah. I come to tell you that if he can do it, uh, nobody can. Yes, yes. Yeah. I come to tell you that he woke us up this morning and started us on our way. Yes, uh, I come to tell you it's no accident uh, that you're breathing right yes. now. Uh, it's no accident uh, that you can Thank see me. Lord. Right oh, now, I come Lord. to tell you, uh, if you did it once, uh, yes, he can do it again. Yes. <laughs> Keep on trusting, uh, keep on believing. Yes. I come to tell you uh, yes, that sir. God <laughs> is still on the throne. Yes. He's the same God uh, that raised Lazarus yes, from the grave. Yes. He's the same God when the yes, woman sir. touched the hem oh, of his garment. He's the same God. Yes, that told that man that was lying at the pool, take up your bed and walk again. And if he did it once, uh, if he did it once, uh, if he did it once, uh, he can do it again. Bless your name, Lord Jesus. Bless his name. Bless his name. Bless his name. All you got to do is believe on God. Uh, yeah. Yeah. yeah, somebody ought to raise your hand and say, 
I believe. I believe. I believe. I believe. If he did it once, he can do it again. Don't you dare give up. Hold on to God's unchanging hand. He's the one that got on the cross and died for you and me. Hallelujah. They hung him on that cross, uh, but then when they took him down, they made a fatal mistake because he told them, if I be lifted, uh, I'll draw all men unto me. Hallelujah. They took him and placed him in a grave uh, for three long days. Uh, but early Sunday morning, he got up with all power in his hand. I come to tell you today, I come to tell you today, if he did it once, yes. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank he can do it again. Yes. I don't know about you, but I'm saved in his arms today. Hallelujah. Bless that wonderful name of Jesus. Come on, give him praise. Come on, give him praise. Come on, give him praise. Bless his name. If he did it once. If he did it once, yes, yes, he yes. can do it again. Yes, sir. Keep on yes, believing. Sir. Keep yes, on sir. trusting. Yes, Don't you doubt God. Hallelujah. You can't make me doubt him because I yes, know too much yes, about him. Yes, Hallelujah. Yes, yes. Don't Hallelujah. doubt God. He can do it Bless again. He's name, able Jesus. to do anything that you need. Hallelujah. Keep on trusting. Be like Job. He told his wife, woman, you must be foolish because he trusted Hallelujah. God and God restored him 100 fold. I come to tell you that if he did it once, he can do it again. We're going to go right into our communion. But before we do, we want to offer you a chance to accept Christ as your personal Savior. Pray this prayer with me. Jesus, come into my life. I'm a sinner, and I need you to save me. I've done some things that I shouldn't have done, but I believe that you did it once. You can do it again. You can save me just like you saved others. Forgive me for the wrong I've done. In Jesus' name, amen. amen. Hallelujah. At this time, I'm going to ask my wife if she would read our scripture for our communion. And we're going to go right in to communion. Bless amen. his name. Amen. Hallelujah. Bless his name. Thank you, Lord. Good morning. Hallelujah. Good morning. We're reading 1 Corinthians chapter 11, verse 23 through 31. For I have received of the Lord that which also I delivered unto you. Yes. That the Lord Jesus, the same night in which he was betrayed, took bread. And when he had given thanks, he broke it and said, Take, eat, this is my body which is broken for you. This do in remembrance of me. After the same manner also he took the cup which he had sucked, saying, This cup is the New Testament in my blood. This do ye as oft as ye drink it in remembrance of me. Hallelujah. For as often as ye eat this bread and drink this cup, ye do show the Lord's death till he come. Wherefore, whosoever shall eat this bread and drink this cup of the Lord unworthily shall be guilty of the body and blood of the Lord. Yes. But let a man examine himself, and so let him eat of that bread and drink of that cup. For he that eateth and drinketh unworthily, eateth and drinketh damnation to himself, not discerning the Lord's body. Yes. For this cause many are weak and sickly among you, and many sleep. Verse 31. For if we would judge ourselves, we should not be judged. May the Lord add a blessing to the reading, the hearers, and most of all, the doers of his word. Bless his name. Let us pray. Father God, we come right now again thanking you, Father, for this day. We thank you, Father, for those that have come right now. Father, there's somebody watching us right now need healing. There's somebody praying for something. You know what it is. Touch right now and grant it to them right now. We thank you, Lord, for being a giving God and a forgiving God. We just say thank you. Let us be worthy of this sacrament today. We give you all the glory. We ask that you bless the wine and the bread that we might partake and we do it in remembrance of you. We thank you for dying on the cross for our sins. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. 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 He took the bread. He broke it. He blessed it. Take all of it. And 
and he took the cup. He poured it. He blessed it. Take all of it. We like to bless God today. We thank God for all of you again for joining in, tuning in. We hope that you was blessed. And remember, if he did it once, he can do it again. Amen. Don't ever give up on God. I don't care what the devil try to do. Remember that you're safe in his arms. We thank God for all of you that have tuned in. <coughs> My allergies are trying to act up. It's springtime. Summer is soon on the way, and these allergies are going crazy. But we thank God for all of you today, and thank yeah, those that, yeah. uh, like we said, that have given out to us. Uh, there are so many names that we can uh, call out. Mother Grant uh, down in Georgia, we thank you. And um, our sister here has really been a blessing to us, and we thank God for her. It's just uh, all of you that watch Sunday after Sunday, yeah, we're just so yeah. thankful. Tell a friend, uh, if you can, hit the like button, uh, leave a comment. Let us know that you've uh, been blessed on this side of heaven. If you like to give to us, you can go to Zelle, gbox2 at verizon.net. That's Zelle, gbox2 at verizon.net. You can give that way. You can go to Cash App and put in gbox Ministries, all capital letters. That's Cash App, gbox Ministries, all capital letters. Or you can write or con and contact us. If you want prayer, you can always send us a letter to 5762 Lincoln Avenue, number 315, Cypress, California, 90630. We thank you. My mind just said, well, let, well, let, we want to thank you for all that yes, you do. Yes, There's yes. so many um, that God just keep putting in my spirit. Thank you for all of you that have poured into our ministry. Yes. And we're so thankful and we, we're doing our best on this side to do the right thing. There's so many people out there false prophets telling you this and telling you that. But I want you to know that God has told us to do his will. And that's yes. what we're doing at G-Bots yes. Ministries. Hey, thank you. And may God bless and keep you is our prayer. Until the next time, remember, if he did it once, he can do it again. Amen.